In this video, I'm going to teach you how to connect VR headset to a Seto Corsa. It's a very easy process, so make sure to follow along. In this video, I'm going to teach you how to connect any compatible VR headset that you have so you can play a Seto Corsa in full virtual reality. For this video, I chose to demonstrate this process with the MetaQuest 2 and the MetaQuest 3 headsets. They are very popular choices and I believe a lot of viewers will have them. However, even if you have different models of VR headsets, you will be able to set them up as long as they are properly connected to your PC. So to start, most of these headsets will be connected using a cable and for the Meta, Quest headset specifically, it is recommended to download the latest version of the Meta or Oculus app. This will allow you to set them up, change a lot of factors about them and see if the status of the headset is good to go. So download the application, sign in with your account and like I said, you will be connecting them primarily with a cable. Using a cable gives you the most performance possible, ensuring that you will have the best experience. But you can use something like AirLink. I'm not going to go over the full process in this video, but AirLink essentially allows you to connect it over a wireless network. Of course, you will need a very strong connection, so keep that in mind. You can also find AirLink on the settings of your Quest headset. If you are using a cable, simply plug it into any available USB port on your PC. Once it is properly connected, if you look inside of the Oculus or Meta app, you will see the model of headset that you are using alongside the status. Of course, if you are using a different VR headset that is not a MetaQuest, you just have to use their application instead to ensure that it is connected. Now, the last thing to do is to go over to your headset and access the Quest Link option. You can also try using Virtual Desktop or Steam VR. And with all of that done, the last thing that you have to do inside of Assetto Quartz itself, if you are using Content Manager, is to go over to the video settings and in here rendering mode you will be able to change it to oculus rift or any other vr headset that you have with all of this done you will be good to go if you start a race through content manager or the standard aceto quartz launcher you will now be playing in virtual reality I hope I was able to help you on how to connect VR headset to a Seto Corta. If this video helped you, please be sure to leave a like and subscribe for more very easy tips. Thank you for watching.